Gambia is expecting to overcome the drowned cases by 2019 as more kids are trained on how to swim and save lives. The recent is the just concluded second edition of the Swim for Life Gambia project, where 30 kids benefited from a month long intensive training course. I Africa Sports reporter Saji Sambo witnessed the colorful event held in Koto and filed in this report. Thirty trained swimmers ranging from the ages of four to seventeen over the weekend graduated from the second edition of swimming course initiated by Swim for Life Gambia, a non governmental organization in the Gambia. The thirty days course was meant to equip swimmers with basic life saving techniques for people exploring the sea for sports and other reasons. Speaking at the closing ceremony, the National Sports Council Chairman Buri Dabo said embrace the initiative as a risk of migration idea for swimmers in the country. Where young children of ages four upwards would be brought in at one venue and trained to be swimmers and to save life, not only Gambians, but residents of the Gambia who uses our waters day in, day out. So this being a second edition uh, is very, very important uh, for the ministry and the Gambia as a nation. For his part, the project coordinator, Sang Mendy, said the reason for initiating such a project is the frequent cases of drowning being reported around the country. As we bring to an end a project designed to train children aged 6 to, 10, no, 6 to 18 to learn how to swim, let me remind you that annually close to 100 people drown in sea or in pools across the country. Out of these drowned cases, lives are lost. Most of the lives lost are of the children between the age bracket we are graduating here today. He called on for help to be able to sustain the project as they are planning for a nationwide swimming training tour. I urge the government of the Gambia, through the Ministry of Youth and Sports, to think of how to embrace such a project. I will also call on the National Olympic Committee to think of how to support such an initiative because this is what we call real catch them young. How can I end without calling on the Minister of tourism and interior. I'm calling on these two ministries because swimming as a laser is done around the tourism development area. Meanwhile, Swim for Gambia is planning to offer safety training for more youth including fishermen throughout the country. For Africa TV Sports, I am Sajo Sambo.